Yo guys, what's up? What's going on? Today I'm gonna show you how to install the VST plugins in Clownfish Voice Changer. This video is actually um, without scripted, so maybe I have a lot of mistakes while speaking English. So just avoid those mistakes and focus on what actually I'm explaining in it. First of all, um, I'm using Clownfish Voice Changer. Let me show you my parrot. I'm using right now the Clownfish version on fish voice changer once you go on this website download okay now let me explain what actually these things are maybe it will confuse you this one is 64 bit this one is 64 bit and this one is 32 bit then what is 64 bit vst with 32 bit vst and 32 bit vst basically these are the uh, uh, sound effects or you can say plugins right now 32 bit VST means it will support 32 bit VST but it's uh, for 64 bit operating system and this one is 64 bit operating system and 64 bit VST will support it and this one is for 32 bit operating system and also supporting the 32 bit VST right now I'm using this one 64 bit with 64 bit VST alright now um, uh, how to install the VST once you open the clownfish from here you will see here the VST effect and then click on the configure effect once you click here it will open a website link add VST actually here we are now the process is explained over here like how you can download the VST and install those in clownfish voice changer I know these things so it's just for you All right? now here is your first vst effect could be the cool we are going on this link now here you will get uh, four different vst actually you can download a lot of uh, different vst from google but right now uh, according to the link you will get here the four vst and it's uh, the first one is cobalt or whatever and send for reverb send for delay pace or tightener I guess I'm going with this one you can use any one actually okay now you need to click on the download you'll get here the download link just install it and open the folder now you need to extract it in the same folder so it's easier to navigate the folder it's Sanford here is the Sanford paste tightener just open it now you will get here the tell files these are the VST you need to copy these and go into the C drive now program files x64 bit and here you need to find the clownfish voice changer now go into the vst right once you are here actually these are not the exact folders i just pasted those recently now you need to paste those uh, vst uh, files over here once you paste here just like this now you will get here the vst effects but for that first you need to close the clownfish voice changer and relaunch it so it will load new files or new VST that you just pasted now VST effects you will see here see send send for base tightener and send for base tightener 32 bit right now as I said I'm using 64 bit VST just click here and uh, I don't know my voice is changed or not but let's try okay first you need to select and then you need to configure effect you will get here now let me hear my own voice first so it will be easier for me what going on so I'm removing this sound and hearing my own voice so now here is VST okay output I'm increasing it to low and uh, my voice is kind of changed right high both and here is the slope effect cutoff frequency I don't know so I don't know much about this VST and there's a lot of VSTs are available on Google you can search for those if you need it and uh, you can just uh, configure VST in your clownfish like this this tutorial is all about how to install VST in your clownfish without getting any error. If you have any question, please let me know in the comment section. See you in the next video. Until then, just take care of yourself and your family. Have a good day. Bye-bye.